are you? Good, you look so cute. You, you look beautiful. We both, we're flowy. Yes, yeah, very flowy. <laughs> very boho, boho chic. <laughs> Today, I'm meeting up with my matchmaker, Michelle, to have a sit-down talk with her. I've been thinking about what happened with Cicero, and it's just not acceptable. It's like a slap in the face, being stood up. And I don't think she wants clients that don't show up on dates. I feel like it's good that we're meeting. You know, I feel like there's a lot that I have to, you know, get off my chest, you know, with Cicero and stuff. Did my part, I just feel like he didn't show. So yeah. that was an awkward He's feeling. Like, yeah. There's no excuse for him not to, to okay. play, right? But it's not okay. Well, we can't you know, we can't say it's okay. It's out of our control. It's out of our control, and I'm not here to like control anybody to say, oh, you know, it is what it is. It, that just that shows me a sign that he's not meant for me. Right. And noticed one day, it was like, it was the same week that we met, he was in a picture with the girl. So I thought that was a little bit of a red flag. Did you ask him about it? Um, no, I didn't ask him about it. At the end of the day, Darcy, I can't control him. I, I want to clear that air because yeah. he, he did give me some feedback. He brought up just a couple of things. One of the things that he did bring up was social media and the optics of it, how it looked. It's one thing to dress sexy. He doesn't want you to egg on other men and bring them on or, or get them to think in a fantasy type of way of you. That was challenging for him. Mm -hmm. I'm a little shocked right now because it was the total opposite of what he's telling you. Yeah. He was like really into it. I think that's a crock. I was looking at your Instagram now. Right? Oh yeah, <laughs> oh boy, okay. I like it. Yeah, yeah, very real, you get it. I'm not doing anything to hurt anybody. I'm just expressing my own goddessness and, you know, beauty. And I'm I'm all for you expressing yeah. your goddessness and your beauty, but the way that your your persona presents is just cool. it's inappropriate. <laughs> okay, I didn't ask for any of this. You're the matchmaker, so if you're gonna match me up with somebody, match me up with someone that's not judgmental on how I live my life. He brought up a couple of other things. So I guess in, during one of the dates, maybe there was a little bit, uh, in, in the date, I should say, there was a little bit too much of alcohol consumption. To him, it was a red flag. To him, it was a red flag of like, oh, well, we're... Interesting. Because he was ordering them for me. But again, it's really important how you're presenting yourself. I'm feeling very disrespected by Michelle. It sounds like Cicero's telling her lies about me. You know, what, what is he saying? I drink too much. Why is he saying that my social media is too sexy? I, I feel like she's blaming me for all of this. It's not right. So what happens from here? Yeah. I don't know. Maybe I'm not ready for the matchmaking thing. You know? So what you're saying to me is that you are wanting to terminate our matchmaking relationship. Yeah, pretty much. You know, I'm sorry to hear that. Tell me what has transpired that I am not privy to. I just feel like it's not really working out. Okay. I've done a lot of the work that you suggested, uh, being open to dating older and different types that I'm not used to. But um, this whole journey with matchmaking and dating has been totally disappointing, but, okay. you know, maybe I just need to kind of just do it on my own. Well, <clears throat> okay. I attempted to highlight some of these patterns of behavior that Darcy I don't think is aware of. She's still single and I can see why. Um, one of the things that I do want to say is, Darcy, look back at all the failed relationships, yeah. the common denominator. Right. There's you. And I wanted to recommend and suggest I have some really amazing friends that are great therapists. Wow. Have you heard this before? No. No. Uh, I've done a lot of the inner work. There's more work to be done. I hired Michelle to be my matchmaker, not a shrink. I didn't sign up for some, you know, mental health assessment here.
It's a low blow. That shows the type of person she is. She wants to do a dig back after I said I wanted to part ways. She said I needed therapy. She needs to take her own advice. Yeah, I definitely picked the wrong matchmaker. All right, I'll see you. Thank you for your time. Ciao.